Tulio is a merchandising platform for the next generation of brands and retailers. It empowers merchants to make faster, data-driven decisions about their most important and expensive asset, inventory. Tulio seamlessly integrates with the commerce tech stack, including solutions like Backbone, NetSuite, Shopify, and Looker. Tulio streamlines the end-to-end planning and merchandising processes from top-down merchandise financial planning and open-to-buy management to seasonal assortment planning and item-level demand forecasting and replenishment, all on a single cloud-based platform. By automating and improving accuracy and visibility around critical merchandise reporting, planning, and forecasting activities, Tulio helps merchants ensure they have the right products at the right place, time, and price. The result is reduced out-of-stocks, improved margins, and faster inventory turns, which ultimately means more revenue to your business. Tulio combines the ease of use and flexibility of spreadsheets with the power of an integrated, automated, and intelligent planning platform. Tulio is designed for mid-sized digitally native brands and retailers, so it comes out of the box with attributes, metrics, and workflows that are based on industry best practices. It's also extremely flexible and customizable, so you can easily personalize the platform from the UI to support your unique planning workflows. While it's our mission to finally get planners and merchants out of spreadsheets, we realize that it's what many are comfortable with, so we've built Tulio on an Excel-like grid-based interface in order to ensure a seamless transition from planning in spreadsheets to planning in Tulio. Diving into an overview of the Tulio platform, we'll start with the dashboards, where all of your plans and reports are centralized and turned into actionable insights. A key benefit of Tulio is that unlike a BI tool, your plans and actuals are integrated, which enables you to easily track progress against plan, analyze reports, and react in real time, all within a single platform. At the top here, you can see important merchandising KPIs and how you're deviating from the plan. You also have visibility into best performing and worst performing products, which look at products that are over or underperforming to plan. This helps you understand which products you should chase into in order to capitalize on sales trends and which ones you should stop investing in in order to avoid tying up cash and stale inventory. Looking at another view of the dashboard, you can see important inventory metrics and their performance to plan. These purchase order suggestions are just another example of actionable insights from the dashboard, which highlight POs I need to place in order to maintain a healthy weeks of supply and avoid any unwanted out of stocks. Moving into the modules, this is where all of the planning and forecasting activities take place. Within the merchandise planning module, planners will work with finance to create top-down sales, inventory, and receipt targets across your different channels, departments, and classes, and effectively manage an open-to-buy plan throughout the season. Within the assortment planning module, planners will collaborate with merchants on seasonal product assortments and new product launches, leveraging historical product and attribute performance information to make data-driven merchandising decisions and more accurately forecast demand for new items. Lastly, within the item planning module, planners will build weekly or monthly item-level demand plans, which Tulio will leverage to make recommendations for purchase orders that are required to maintain optimal inventory levels across your products. Heading back to the merchandise planning module, as you can see, Tulio looks and feels a lot like Excel. Things like copying and pasting, functions and shortcuts, and importing and exporting data to and from spreadsheets are all supported within the platform. But there are so many reasons why Tulio is much more powerful than spreadsheets, where merchants typically need to maintain 15 to 20 disparate planning and reporting files. In Tulio, all of your plans and reports are centralized updated in real time, and archived within a single platform. In Tulio, you can roll up and plan at any level within your merchandise hierarchy, which enables streamlined top-down, bottom-up, and middle-out planning. On the fly, you can also update the hierarchy or filter by any product attribute, which enables you to plan with more rigor and granularity. Tulio also comes out of the box with these pre-built views that support common planning and reporting workflows. However, they're easily customized by selecting and rearranging a subset of the about 100 different retail metrics and variants on those metrics that come out of the box with Tulio. We're in a preseason planning view here, but switching over to the finance view, you can see a different set of metrics that are important to the finance team and leverage the same underlying data. 
Lastly, through the integrations, Tulio automatically actualizes your plan, which enables real-time reporting and saves planners hours per week from manually pulling and massaging data and spreadsheets. Looking at our 2021 plan here, you can see February through May have been automatically updated and locked, while the remainder of the year is still planable. Heading back to the preseason planning view, I'll take you through a quick planning workflow. When creating a plan preseason, you start by seeding information from the past. This pulls in all of your historical data and trends, including your seasonality curve over time and your contribution mix across your merchandise hierarchy. This gives you a starting point, and from there, you can make lots of top-down, bottom-up, and middle-out adjustments. First, let's set a target of growing the top-line revenue 10% year-over-year. When inputting the 10% growth target here, Tulio spreads that growth over time, respecting the seasonality curve, and over my merchandise hierarchy, respecting the contribution mix. Then, let's say I want to keep the total number constant, but I want to run a promotion during the month of November to grow my sales. I can lock the total number here and make the adjustment to November, which takes care of taking away growth from other months respecting the seasonality curve and spreading the growth down in the month of November respecting the contribution margin. After making all of the adjustments to your top line revenue across your divisions and departments, you can plan other metrics like AUR, discounts, margins, and weeks of supply, with the final output of the merchandise plan being the receipts you need to place across your business over time. Then, in season, switching over to the open to buy view, by centralizing sales, inventory, and purchase order information, Tulio gives you real time visibility into your open to buy. Lastly, Tulio enables you to create different versions or snapshots of your plans for scenario playing and reforecasting capabilities. For example, at the beginning of a season, you can create a snapshot of your original plan. Then in season, as you're reforecasting, you can compare your original plan to your current plan and make the necessary adjustments to your plan to get the business back on track. Heading over to the assortment planning module, this is where merchants plan for seasonal assortments and new product introductions based on guidance and guardrails from the merchandise plan. Starting with the summary page, you can see all of the assortments the team is working on, how they performed in the past, and how the current line plans are rolling up. This critical reconciliation capability makes sure that the merchandising and product development processes will support the top-down financial goals that were established in the merchandise plan. Clicking into an assortment, you can see a high-level summary of the line plan and a product mix visualization to show the assortment composition. In the line planning section below, merchants can add new products or placeholders to the assortment, including all of the relevant attributes, costing information, and plans for each color choice. Unlike Excel, images are native in Tulio, which enables a much more visual workflow. Tulio also provides control around the attributes and other important product identification factors, which is critical for data integrity and accuracy. One of the common challenges merchants have is understanding how a new product will perform when they have no historical data to reference. A key capability of assortment planning is hindsighting, which enables you to easily access and operationalize historical product information during the line planning process. Tulio enables you to leverage historical product performance to create like-for-like -like choices or placeholders within your assortment that associate new products to similar items from the past. This like-for-like -like choice generates a recommendation for the size curve and seasonality curve of the past product to the new product you're launching. This helps you forecast the size mix and the overall demand. For an omnichannel brand or retailer, Tulio would also help you allocate this product across channels and stores. Finally, when a merchant completes the lines, the output is the purchase orders required for this assortment, which can be exported as a CSV, imported into the ERP, or pushed into the item planning module so that planners can create more granular demand plans for new items over time. Moving to the item planning module, 
Tulio can help you generate weekly or monthly item level demand forecasts, inventory projections, and receipt plans. The output of this module are purchase order suggestions required for replenishment. Generating forecasts at the SKU level in spreadsheets is an extremely manual and cumbersome process and can typically only be done on a monthly cadence. Tulio makes this process easy so you're enabled to reforecast on a weekly basis for improved forecasting accuracy. Selecting a product you want to forecast, you can choose the seasonality curve and the time range from which Tulio should leverage the trend and the target time range for which you want Tulio to generate a forecast. By applying the original seasonality curve to recent trend data, Tulio generates a new forecast with a more accurate depiction of demand. Once a forecast is generated, you can generate a receipt plan that will ensure you avoid any out of stocks without tying up too much cash in inventory. Select the products you want to generate a receipt plan for, input the replenishment criteria such as safety stock targets, minimum order quantity, and order cycles, and hit generate receipts. Switching over to the PO suggestions view, you can see the inventory required to meet demand, what is already on order, and the purchase orders you need to place. These PO suggestions can be imported via CSV or integrated with their ERP in order to help automate the PO generation process. To quickly recap, we went through an end-to-end -end planning and merchandising workflow in Tulio. We started off by creating the top-down targets across the channels and departments within the merchandise planning module, which we used as budgets and targets for merchandising in the assortment planning module. We wrapped up the demo by creating item level demand forecasts and the receipts that were required to meet demand while maintaining optimal inventory levels. By centralizing and automating all of your plans within Tulio, merchants can save hours of time, improve visibility and demand forecasting accuracy, and make faster data-driven merchandising decisions.